the students it is the third video for week 3 just look at this picture and tell what do you feel about it it is the picture of the flood 2020 second happened in pakistan and caused lots of devastation in which thousands of people became homeless every precious property belonged to them was destroyed infrastructures of the city that also inhilated mean everything was completely whitewashed and the life of lives of the people children became miserable well our feelings about it don't you feel that we should help these people we should ask the other members to contribute we should promote and make some efforts yes of course and i'm sure that most of you also have talked about it have given suggestions have asked the people as we in our departments here in BIT uh, the generous contributions were made people were asked to help out the needy and poor and those who had something whatever they had they contributed this is called persuasion persuasion means to ask some people to excite someone to invite someone is called persuasions and persuasion is a very powerful tool utilized in social setting for example you found while traveling in <clears throat> rawalpindi murray road that there were different organizations they were calling the people inviting the people <clears throat> encouraging the people to help out the needy well come and see what persuasion and the persuasive writing is introduction to persuasive writing a persuasive text is a form of non fiction writing that aims to convince the readers of a certain reader they convince the readers to follow a certain point of view fine means persuasive writing is a text or a purpose pers persuasive writing or persuasive message is an oral message which aims to invite the people share their interest to uh give them advices to seek help to keep from or to refrain from certain things this all is called persuasions let's for example in the simplest manner we say these days dengue virus or the dengue fever is the more fatal for everyone and you find the daily students and the teachers and the relatives they uh, fall in prey to this uh, disorder and same time you find lots of information on internet in schools and colleges in advertisements they saying that avoid dengue means do not let the 
uh, water open find uh, remove the trash check your self if you feel fever go to doctor uh, get the laboratory tests what are they they all are persuasive message which are being delivered to the people clear and the purpose is to convince the old reader or the listener to follow a specific point of view clear the examples of such are advertisements newspaper columns political speech informative speech promotional text marketing content they all are the persuasive text in persuasive writing it includes a main point of view and then they and circle the entire discussion around it clear in persuasive writing we use the relevant arguments in the support of our point of view and we also use conclusions and summaries the students examples of persuasive writing advertisements advertisements are very powerful product of the persuasive writing an advertisement aims to promote the product by expressing its benefit clear they promote sales fine in which different kind of uh, inviting expressions are used for example most of you are familiar with a famous brand nike and nike gives the sl slogan just do it waves nami kafi hai clear and in which they invite come and see how we are serving clear so in the persuasive writings in advertisements persuasive writing is used a lot in marketing content clear uh, for example uh, real estate marketing and everybody uh, has had little bit experience or interaction with the real estate agents and their brochures their conversation the map they create and by many means they excite the interest of people sir this is a new colony it is uh, uh, along with this colony uh, soon there will be a ring road uh, marketing uh, th there is marketing area and much more I mean they uh, create lots of fascinations for the people just to sell out their product now the speech speech are also a powerful tool of public speaking and let me say that public speaking skills like speech are the first basic requirement for the leader to build opinions to clear the point of view to teach the people to excite the people in pakistan we find speech on many way i would say it that pakistan may be the only country where speech are delivered in abundance fine for example uh, in political stage you find that political leaders of the right and left both deliver speech they excite their workers to stage a sit in 
to take part in a procession, okay, and many more. And the language they use, often hyperbole, they use fictitious expressions. I mean, they utilize everything that can urge the people. And second is, in the social life we find speech, in the our belief or in the mosques and shrines where the ulamas and scholars they share their uh, I mean they share the content from the Quran and the and the other sources and they ask the people to follow the good deeds and they tell the people not to uh, commit the bad and really in Holy Quran we find speech and the persuasive language in a lot in which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has asked the people to uh, and told about them about Jannat about the pandemonium mean the hell clear and some tidings about the day of judgment fine and much more well persuasive writing is used in promotional materials as i have already explained that in the marketing content in uh, promotional videos we find that they design their content to to convince the reader to increase the interest next leaf political leaflets reviews reviews means this is very important but uh, persuasive writing for example one you have once you have I mean uh, you order something in Amazon and you find that down there are reviews of the customers that they share their experience and they tell the product type delivery manner of payment their satisfaction level and down they ask the people that they should uh, they should purchase it or not even down there there are icons given stars when you press one two three four means once a person has given some video two stars three stars actually it is kind of a review clear and reviews are about everything about <clears throat> food Reviews are written about film, movie, medicine. I mean, there are lots of reviews. These reviews are written by two ways. One review is written by the experts. For example, some person watched a movie and then he wrote the review. And that may be paid one. Fine. And... Other views, as already has been expressed by the general public, fine. So, in writing careers, we also found that uh, review writing can be another career that a literate person, expert in writing, is invited <coughs> to read the book and write a review. Fine. If you uh, sign in Upwork, you find lots of assignments of same nature in which the review, review writing is in which the review writing is given. Fundraising letters. Fundraising it is a term which is used in the West and is quite familiar. Fundraising means in other words, let me translate it. 
चंदा इकट्ठा करना टू कलेक्ट द मनी फॉर अ सर्टन प्रोजेक्ट इन्वेस्ट फॉर एग्जाम्पल सम पर्सन इज अ कंप्यूटर प्रोफेशनल हैज अ वेरी गुड आइडिया बट डजेंट हैव द रिसोर्सेज एंड रिसोर्स कम फर्स्ट द फर्स्ट थिंग फॉर हिम टू कॉन्टिन्यू द प्रोजेक्ट obviously is the money capital and now he has to devise a policy to collect the capital mean to raise the funds he chalks out the entire idea on the paper and takes this concept to different firms explain them his project <clears throat> the scope of the project and the cost and uh, the share he wants from that company and also discusses what stake or what benefit that company may have from that uh project they call fundraising letters or emails it is also offer letters for example uh, you are working you are you have opened a software house okay and you need the business you would write the emails to schools and different uh, restaurants or shopping malls or the food markets and others and would ask tell those people about <clears throat> the kind of services you are providing and will <clears throat> sorry ask them to uh, have a software from you clear and then propaganda propaganda is <clears throat> means to say something some idea concept belief repeatedly on to the people and to arrest the attention of the people and don't let them think over to another thing is called propaganda means a person uh propagates his own ideas and never let the listen to other so propaganda is one of the very powerful tool it is used in media it has been used to psychologically defeat the countries and the people fine and uh, before the start of the actual wars that this is a very technical game that before the countries wage a war against some country they start their propaganda machines allegations different kind of uh, uh past event uh videos and movies they are made and to build the public opinion and to justify their attack let's for example americans when russians in past soviet union uh captured afghanistan americans took it a bright opportunity and they made the very famous film rambo in which they found that the people of afghanistan they are in extreme trouble and the russians are uh killing them and there is a genocide and uh, there are no law and order situation human rights which is a big tool they say is violated and then the films was circulated all over the world and people watched and the public opinion and the world opinion went against russia and then americans came and they started the cold war similar thing happened in the middle east about saddam hussein kazafi and other and the uh allegations of the uh weapons of mass destruction uh were given and they came with the revival of the uh basic human rights so this all is the propaganda and say propaganda you find in uh here in our political system 
that before something new is in, we find the journalists and the writers and the other people start talking about it. You find the social media is filled with such posts. So propaganda itself is a huge uh, game. Fine. Well, move to the other letters of recommendation. Cover letters, editorials, articles, argumentative essays for the academic papers. They also have the touch of the persuasive writing. Students move next. In persuasive writing, we use rhetorical questions. Clear? And the answer in, in uh, the purpose of asking the rhetorical question is not to collect information from them, rather to engage their interests. For example, when you listen to uh, TED Talks are very creative and artistic speakers. They often start the discussion from the question. For example, if they are going to talk about some a beautiful lake, they would start like, have you ever been to a spectacular place in your life? What do you feel over there? Really? If so, then you are having the same experience as we had the last day in the northern areas. Lakes, mountains, river, lush green fields and meadows. Fine. So this is the rhetoric questions. They catch the attention of the uh, uh, listener or the spectator. Similarly, rhetoric questions, most of the advertisements start with, uh, for example, uh, iodine. The, there was an uh, advertisement about the weakness of the uh, children in which they use the expression kya ka bacha kamzor hai kya wo sahi tarike se chal nahi pata agar aisa hai to ye iodine ki kami ka shikar hai fine so this kind of and same expression you find in the safeguard advertisements and in most they use the rhetoric question as the pinch line and from that rhetoric question they build the narrative and they introduce their product and in the same minute they uh, give the solution and uh, electronic ad is a powerful is quite a powerful uh, persuasive product that within 40 to 50 seconds they tell the huge drama they tell the huge story Clear? In process of writing, emotional language is used. Clear? And in persuasive writing, facts and statistics are also expressed. Irrespective whether those facts and statistics are real or not. Clear? Just like in safeguard, that the safeguard kills 99.9% .9 of the uh, germs which are found on the earth it keeps provide you 100% safety clear and the repetition repetition means say what you want repeatedly in the mind and a time comes when that thing covers the brain and build the public opinion therefore you find that uh, now well, let's interesting uh, uh, let's find an interesting fact. Now the World Cup, ICC 2020 World Cup is uh, 
near and you find that in after uh, an hour there is interval and repeated advertisements are shown because they find that now this moment millions of people are watching them and show this advertisement advertisement repeatedly and thus they increase their sale uh the students now i'm sure that you have a little better idea about the persuasive writing and further other ideas model verbs and adverbs like must should have to do it they are used in the persuasive writing the students now from the assignment just read out the handout and have more clear idea secondly there are two options number one we should write a speech on anything any topic like the importance of the computer science in our current world okay the safety and hygiene clear environment fine I mean you have to write a speech on any of the topic related to social aspects environment academia clear in which you want that the people should learn about it and they should follow the certain points and change them thank you very much